Right, this morning we're excited to launch a brand new segment here on Arc Seattle. We're calling it Steve's Snapshot. Yeah, I love this idea. So every day like me, you're likely amazed by some of the beautiful shots that local photographers capture of our special region. Uh, this new segment allows us to introduce you to some of the men and women behind the lenses. And joining us this morning is Robert Chisholm, all the way from Federal Way. Robert, good morning to you. Good morning. Nice to have you with us this morning. So you're an award-winning photographer based right here in Washington, and you might have seen some of his great work on social media. Robert, tell us about how your passion for photography got started. Basically, in uh, 2014, I was taking a lot of pictures with my phone camera, and uh, my wife told me, she's like, I think you really have a good eye. And I was like, okay. So I just kept taking pictures, and so she bought me a really nice uh, Canon camera. And um, at first I didn't use it, I was intimidated by it. <laughs> and then um, we went on a lot of traveling, so I started using it. And um, things just started you know, going a little bit more and more and to, to the point to where I, I really got good at it. And I, I felt like, okay, what, you know, what could be next? And uh, putting it out on social media and things like that, people really liked it. And so it was kind of just things snowballed a little bit more and more. I entered some competitions and put some things out like into uh, art walks and things like that. And people really enjoyed it and appreciated it. So it was it was really great. Um, so speaking up to this point, um, I just continued with it and it has become a passion and I continue to do it today. All thanks to the wife. I love it. <laughs> oh yeah, 100%. <laughs> your pictures are awesome. Um, I know that reflection photography is your favorite. Tell us what that is and why it's your favorite to shoot. Um, I guess I say my first real um, shot that I did with reflection, I went to the Space Needle and um, I was trying to get a really good shot of it, just, just the space on itself. And there, there was a puddle right in front of me and I'd, it was a clear picture and I couldn't believe it. I was like, wow. So I, I got a shot of it, but I didn't really do too much with it. I, I sat around with it. And then one time I started doing a little work, a little editing on it. And um, I submitted on the same thing on social media and just people really, really enjoyed it. And then from there, I just started seeing like every time I went somewhere, you know, the weather was, you know, raining or something. And so the puddles always presented themselves. And uh, I just started doing a lot of that. And that's just become one of my favorite things to do. Robert, I really enjoy your work. And I was struck by this quote that you have posted on the, the front page of your website. Um, and it reads in part, photography is an art of observation. It has little to do with the things that you see and everything to do with the way that you see them. I'm curious why you chose that quote for your site and, and what, is that, what does that mean to you? It means to me that o over everything, when you get to do anything creative or you're, you're putting your energy, positive energy into something and you go, you know, the what you see and, and how it, you perceive things um, and, and how you enjoy things, um, it, it, that's what it's all about. Just, just getting out there, having fun and, and doing you know, what you love, but just ultimately having fun and having some passion for it. And so I just thought of like the creativity, the mental side of it, like what, what's, I guess what drives you to, to take a picture or, or see things, I, I just think that that's the most important thing. I love that quote too. It's very intentional and uh, we just appreciate you being on the show. You're the very first guest on our new segment, Steve Snapshots. And my last oh, question for you cool. is, are you gonna go out this weekend, enjoy the sunshine and take some pictures? Yes, I am. I'm gonna be out there taking pictures. <laughs> nice. How often do you go, Robert? I try to at least twice a week, I try to get out and, and, and shoot. And a lot of times, like I was saying, with the traveling, I, I just took the camera with me and what happened happened. It, I wasn't really like real intentional where I was like, you know, I'm gonna go get this shot. I just said, hey, what if, if I get something, I get something. And usually I, I come back with, with something. Yeah. Wow. Incredible. Very gifted. Thanks for your time, Robert. It was, it was really great Thank to meet you, so you after all this me. time. Yeah, it was great to meet you. If you're interested yeah, no. in uh, seeing more of Robert's work, sorry about that, <laughs> or buying any of his prints, uh, we made it easy for you. Just scan that QR code on your screen. That's going to take you directly to our uh, website at comonews.com slash hotlinks. That's where you'll find a link to Robert's website to check out his work.